folks, Chris the Lizard. We're starting this fix cam with a pop quiz. We have three numbers up here, 55, 59, 62. What do they mean? Anyone? Bueller? All right, I'll answer my own question. 55, that's the percentage that President Bush got in Illinois' 14th district, lost in a special election by Republicans. 59, that's his percentage in Louisiana's 6th district, another special election lost by Republicans. This big boy right here, 62, that's the number Bush got in Mississippi 1, the district that Democrats just took over last Tuesday in a special election. How about one more number I'll add down here, 54. That's the percentage of the vote the Democrat got in a, Bush, in a district that President Bush won 62% of the vote. All of that equals, thank you, these three things. Global warming, this is part two of the quiz, global warming out of Iraq, 2013, Hurricane Katrina. Now this uh, seems like the agenda of whoever the Democratic nominee is. Barack Obama would seem pretty happy with those three agenda points. It's not. This is in fact the agenda that John McCain has outlined in the last three or four weeks. Global warming, he said we need to address it, it is a problem, and even if you don't believe it is a problem, we should address it anyway because what's the, what, what's the harm done? Out of Iraq 2013, McCain has said, he said this morning in Columbus, Ohio, he believes we can win in Iraq by 2013 and have most of the troops come home. An amazing admission for a candidate who has said that, uh, you know, we need to stay, keep troops there until we win. He is saying we can win by this date, 2013, uh, and they can come home. The other, Hurricane Katrina. McCain went down to New Orleans. He criticized the Bush administration's handling of it. He says it's a disaster. We need to do better. These two things, these two categories, these two questions have a lot to do with one another. When you see Republicans losing districts, 55, 59, 62, it speaks to the problems with the Republican brand. The Republican brand, people are tired of it. You see 60, 70, even 80% of the American public saying the country is off on the wrong track and blaming President Bush largely uh, for taking them on the wrong track. It's why you see McCain trying to reinvent the party, talking about things, uh, uh, domestic issues, Hurricane Katrina, sort of domestic foreign policy, global warming, and certainly foreign policy out of Iraq, that is outside of the Bush model of governance. Will it work? That's the big question. You know, Republicans have a very short period of time to make it work. Uh, November 2008 is the end date here for, for this election. If these three races are any indication, you're looking at 20 plus seat losses for Republicans, which even if McCain can win on this agenda, is going to put him with a very, uh, Congress stacked quite a bit against him in the House and the Senate. So this dynamic is the key dynamic to watch over the next few weeks and months. Can Republicans turn this, which is a disaster, into something like this, where they are known for things that break away from the Bush administration? We shall see. Thanks for taking the pop quiz. I love these whiteboards. I'm Chris Saliza, WashingtonPost.com. Everyone hates the sad.